the robotics and artificial intelligence department, part of the computer science department, and students who are majoring in computer science, there's a track that they can take called robotics and vision, and within that they would learn things like robotics, artificial intelligence, machine learning, data mining, which are critical to robotics, and we actually use physical robots that they'll be programming uh, while they're going through that major. I've been involved in a whole lot of different things just through the robotics department, like for instance working with these NAO robots. Uh, we have uh, NAO robots, which are the humanoid robots, and then we have Lego robots that we use quite a bit in the introductory classes. And then we have Hercules, which is a much larger robot with infrared sensors, bumper sensors, and so on that they can program. This is an Oculus Rift. Basically what you do is you wear this, and then you wear two armbands, and through the use of the Oculus and the armbands, you can control the robot completely. So as you move your arms, it moves its arms with you. You open and close your hands, it's able to open and close them as you do it. You basically have complete control over the robot. Uh, just this past spring, I got an internship at CMU's Create Lab. There, I am an app developer. Specifically, there's this project called Flutter, where it's just this little robot where you can plug sensors into it. Say, like a soil moisture sensor. Through the app that I make, the kid can then program a robot to then turn on a light bulb when the soil is dry. Through being in the department, I've been able to go to many different places actually. Harrisburg was one of them where we went and uh, did a robotics demo for advocacy day. Basically was able to show these robots off to different legislators and senators. Show them that Slippery Rock does a lot of cool things that you know you might not expect. One of the things that the employees are looking for is what kind of experience do you have? Can you uh, actually program real life robots or devices? Pretty much everything has a capability for programming. The robots have become a critical part of it. So we learn everything from Bluetooth to wireless uh, and to programming complexity like vision programming, artificial intelligence, which ensure, ensures that they end up getting good jobs when they graduate.